The James Webb Space Telescope, JWST, frequently hailed as the replacement to the Hubble Space Telescope, has changed how we might interpret the universe. Since its send-off, the telescope has given an uncommon perspective on the universe, uncovering secrets and revealing phenomena previously unheard of by humankind. The JWST's cutting-edge technology has permitted researchers to look into the farthest reaches of space, investigating worlds, stars, and planetary systems formed billions of years ago. This paper digs into the numerous features of the JWST, from its technological wonders to its weighty discoveries, and examines how it has reshaped our comprehension of the universe. To appreciate the significance of the JWST, understanding its fundamental predecessor, the Hubble Space Telescope, is essential. Launched in 1990, Hubble provided astronomers with the first clear pictures of distant galaxies, nebulae, and stars, free from the obscuring effects of Earth's atmosphere. Hubble's contributions to science are endless, from determining the rate of the universe's expansion to observing the impact of comet Shoemaker-Levy 9 with Jupiter. Its deep field images, capturing light from galaxies billions of light years away, have given us a brief look into the early universe. However, despite its triumphs, Hubble had limitations. Its primary mirror, with a 2.4-meter diameter, limited its light-gathering ability, and its instruments were designed for ultraviolet, visible, and near-infrared wavelengths of light. As cosmologists pushed the boundaries of our understanding, it became clear that a new telescope was needed, one capable of seeing in the infrared range, where it could peer through vast dust clouds and observe the universe's first galaxies. The idea for the James Webb Space Telescope began to take shape in the mid-1990s, even before Hubble had reached its full potential. Named after James E. Webb, NASA's administrator during the Apollo era, the JWST was proclaimed as the next great observatory, a telescope that would look further back in time than Hubble, capturing light from the first stars and galaxies that formed after the Big Bang. The JWST design presented significant engineering challenges. Unlike Hubble, which orbits Earth at an altitude of around 570 kilometers, the JWST would be located at the second Lagrange point, L2, about 1.5 million kilometers from Earth. This location offers a stable environment with minimal interference from Earth's heat and light, but also means that the telescope cannot be serviced or repaired by astronauts. To observe the faint, distant objects it was designed to study, the JWST required a much larger mirror than Hubble. The solution was a segmented mirror made of 18 hexagonal beryllium segments, coated with gold, giving the telescope an overall diameter of 6.5 meters. This mirror had to be folded to fit inside the Ariane 5 rocket that would launch it and would only unfold once the telescope reached its destination. The JWST also required a sunshield to block heat and light from the sun, earth, and moon keeping the telescope's instruments at their operating temperature of just a few degrees above absolute zero. The sunshield, the size of a tennis court, is made of five layers of a special material called captain, which can withstand extreme temperatures. After years of planning, delays, and cost overruns, the JWST was finally launched on December 25, 2021. The launch was a groundbreaking event, watched by scientists and space enthusiasts around the world. The Ariane 5 rocket carried the telescope into space, and over the following 30 days, the JWST embarked on a complex and carefully planned series of deployments. The Sun Shield was the first critical component to deploy, a process that involved many moving parts and thousands of components working together as a unified whole. Any failure could have doomed the mission. Once the Sun Shield was successfully deployed, the mirror segments began to unfold and align themselves. This process took several months, as each segment had to be positioned with nanometer precision. By mid-2022, the JWST had completed its deployment and calibration, and its instruments were ready to begin capturing data. The first images released to the public were truly stunning. The telescope's ability to observe in the infrared revealed the universe in a new light, with breathtaking clarity and detail. One of the primary objectives of the JWST is to observe the first galaxies that formed after the Big Bang over 13 billion years ago. These galaxies are so distant that their light has been stretched into the infrared part of the spectrum due to the expansion of the universe, a phenomenon known as redshift. Hubble could glimpse these distant objects, 
but the JWST's infrared capabilities allow it to see them in unprecedented detail. In its first year of operation, the JWST made several groundbreaking discoveries. One of the most significant was the detection of galaxies that existed just a few hundred million years after the Big Bang. These galaxies appeared to be more massive and mature than previously thought, challenging existing theories of galaxy formation and evolution. Scientists had long assumed that the first galaxies were small and slowly grew over time by merging with other galaxies. However, the JWST observations suggest that some galaxies formed much more rapidly and grew larger than expected, prompting cosmologists to reconsider their models of how galaxies form and evolve. The JWST also captured images of massive structures never seen before. For example, the telescope observed the intricate details of the cosmic web, an enormous network of filaments that connects galaxies across the universe. These filaments, made of dark matter and gas, provide the scaffolding on which galaxies form and evolve. The JWST's observations of the cosmic web have provided new insights into the large-scale structure of the universe and the role of dark matter in shaping it. The JWST has also revolutionized our understanding of star formation and stellar evolution. Stars form in dense clouds of gas and dust, which block visible light. However, infrared light can penetrate these clouds, allowing the JWST to observe the process of star formation in unprecedented detail. One of the telescope's earliest targets was the Orion Nebula, a stellar nursery located about 1,344 light years from Earth. The JWST's images revealed numerous young stars some still embedded in their natal clouds. These observations have provided new insights into how stars form and evolve, as well as the processes that lead to the formation of planetary systems. The JWST has also observed the final stages of stellar evolution, capturing stunning images of dying stars and the nebulae they create. These observations have shed light on the processes that govern the end of a star's life, including the formation of white dwarfs, neutron stars, and black holes. One of the most intriguing aspects of the JWST mission is its ability to study exoplanets, planets that orbit stars outside our solar system. The telescope's instruments are capable of examining the atmospheres of these distant worlds, searching for signs of habitability and potentially life. In its first year of operation, the JWST made several major discoveries related to exoplanets. One of the most notable was the detection of LHS 475b an exoplanet located about 41 light-years from Earth. This planet is roughly the same size as Earth and orbits its star in just two days. The JWST's observations revealed that LHS 475b has a thick atmosphere, possibly made of water vapor, carbon dioxide, or methane. The JWST has also observed other exoplanets with varying atmospheres. Some of these planets have thick, cloudy atmospheres rich in methane and other hydrocarbons, while others have clear atmospheres dominated by hydrogen and helium. These observations have provided valuable data on the diversity of planetary systems and the conditions that could support life. One of the most fascinating questions in cosmology is whether life exists elsewhere in the universe. While the JWST cannot directly detect life, it can search for biosignatures, chemical markers that could indicate the presence of life. For example, the detection of oxygen or methane in an exoplanet's atmosphere could suggest the presence of biological processes. The JWST's ability to study exoplanets has opened a new era in the search for life beyond Earth. As the telescope continues to observe more planets, it will provide crucial data that could help answer the age-old question. Are we alone in the universe? In addition to its investigations of distant worlds and exoplanets, the JWST has captured images of some of the most beautiful and mysterious objects in the universe. One of the most striking is the Tarantula Nebula, a massive star-forming region located in the Large Magellanic Cloud, a satellite galaxy of the Milky Way. The Tarantula Nebula, also known as 30 Doradus, is a vast region of gas and dust where thousands of new stars are being born. The JWST's images of this region reveal intricate filaments of gas, glowing clusters of young stars, and the remnants of supernova explosions. These observations have provided new insights into the processes that drive star formation and the life cycles of massive stars. The JWST has also captured breathtaking images of nebulae, 
such as the Carina Nebula and the Eagle Nebula, revealing details that were previously hidden from view. These images have not only captivated the public's imagination, but have also provided valuable data for astronomers studying the birth and death of stars. While the JWST has made incredible strides in our understanding of the universe, its journey has not been without challenges and controversies. The telescope's development was plagued by delays and cost overruns, with a final price tag reaching nearly $10 billion, significantly higher than the original estimate. These issues led to debates among astronomers and policymakers about the project's feasibility and value. Some critics argued that the funds dedicated to the JWST could have been better spent on other scientific endeavors, while others contended that the telescope's potential for groundbreaking discoveries justified the expense. The James Webb Space Telescope's mission is not just a scientific endeavor but a human achievement that transcends borders and generations. Its discoveries are already rewriting textbooks and expanding our understanding of the universe. However, its full impact will unfold over decades as the JWST continues to explore the cosmos. It will undoubtedly make more groundbreaking discoveries, pushing the limits of human knowledge and inspiring future generations to reach for the stars. The James Webb Space Telescope has undoubtedly opened a new chapter in humankind's quest to understand the universe, and its legacy will be felt for generations to come. The JWST is not only a giant leap in space observation but also a testament to human ingenuity and perseverance. Its mission extends beyond simply observing distant celestial objects. It aims to answer some of the most profound questions about the universe. One of the primary areas of interest for the JWST is the study of the early universe, focusing on the formation of the first galaxies and stars. This is critical because understanding the conditions and processes that led to the formation of the first galaxies will help astronomers unravel the cosmic mystery of how the universe evolved from the Big Bang to its present state. The JWST's ability to observe these early galaxies relies on its advanced infrared capabilities. The universe has been expanding since the Big Bang, causing the light from distant objects to stretch and shift towards the infrared part of the spectrum. This redshift effect makes it difficult for telescopes designed to observe visible light, like Hubble, to capture these ancient objects in detail. By operating in the infrared range, the JWST can penetrate through cosmic dust clouds and observe these early galaxies with remarkable clarity, providing a deeper understanding of their structure and composition. Another major focus of the JWST is the study of star formation and the life cycles of stars. The process of star formation occurs in dense regions of gas and dust, which often obscure these areas from visible light observation. The JWST's infrared capabilities allow it to peer through these dust clouds and capture detailed images of newborn stars and their surrounding environments. This insight into star formation is essential for understanding the life cycle of stars, including how they evolve and eventually end their lives. By studying these processes, Scientists can learn more about the production of elements and the formation of planetary systems, which are critical to understanding the conditions that make life possible. The JWST has also been designed to study the atmospheres of exoplanets, planets that orbit stars outside our solar system. The telescope's instruments can analyze the chemical composition of these atmospheres, searching for potential signs of habitability. One of the methods used is transit spectroscopy where the telescope observes the light from the host star as it passes through the exoplanet's atmosphere during a transit. This technique can reveal the presence of various molecules, such as water vapor, carbon dioxide, and methane, which are essential indicators of a planet's potential to support life. The JWST's contributions to our understanding of exoplanets go beyond identifying potential biosignatures. It also provides valuable information on the atmospheric properties of these planets including their temperature, pressure, and cloud cover. This data helps scientists develop models of exoplanetary climates and weather systems, offering insights into the diverse environments that exist in other planetary systems. Such information is crucial for identifying planets that might have conditions similar to Earth, thereby narrowing the search for extraterrestrial life. The telescope's ability to observe the cosmic web, the vast network of filaments connecting galaxies, is another area where the JWST has made significant contributions. 
The cosmic web is made up of dark matter and gas and plays a key role in the structure and evolution of the universe. Observations of the cosmic web can provide insights into the distribution of dark matter, which remains one of the greatest mysteries of modern cosmology. Understanding how dark matter influences the formation and growth of galaxies helps astronomers refine their models of cosmic evolution. In addition to its scientific endeavors, the JWST has become a symbol of international collaboration in space exploration. The project involved contributions from multiple space agencies, including NASA, the European Space Agency, ESA, and the Canadian Space Agency, CSA. This global partnership embodies the collective effort required to achieve such an ambitious scientific goal. The successful launch and deployment of the JWST are the result of years of cooperative work, overcoming numerous technical and logistical challenges. Furthermore, the JWST has had a profound impact on public interest and education in astronomy and space science. Its stunning images and groundbreaking discoveries have captured the imagination of people around the world, inspiring a new generation of scientists, engineers, and space enthusiasts. The telescope's ability to reveal the universe in such striking detail helps foster a greater appreciation for the complexities of the cosmos and the importance of scientific inquiry. As the JWST continues its mission, it is expected to provide an abundance of new data that will fuel scientific research for many years to come. Its discoveries will likely lead to new questions and theories, driving further investigations into the nature of the universe. The telescope's observations will also contribute to ongoing research in a wide range of fields, from the formation of planetary systems to the study of cosmic phenomena. In summary, the James Webb Space Telescope represents a remarkable advancement in our quest to understand the universe. Its cutting-edge technology and infrared capabilities allow it to explore new frontiers in cosmology, offering insights into the earliest galaxies, the formation of stars, and the potential for life on other planets. The telescope's contributions extend beyond scientific discovery, serving as a beacon of international collaboration and public inspiration. As it continues to operate, the JWST will undoubtedly shape our understanding of the universe and inspire future generations to explore the mysteries of space.